Good morning, Arizona. Waking up on a Saturday morning. My name is Rex Perry, and this is called Business to Business Radio. We do high-speed networking with real estate agents, giving out names and phone numbers. Our co-host is... Jeff Obraski, Homeowners Financial Group. And we like to do remote broadcasts from a beautiful vacant luxury homes a beautiful home uh, our first guest is bryce introduce yourself please i am bryce shots and i'm with the you call the shots team out of west usa realty uh, our team has over 54 years combined uh, experience and i'm actually a second generation phoenix native here and a third generation realtor in the valley fantastic and we're doing a remote broadcast from one of your listings describe where we're at first yeah, no, this is a, a beautiful home. It's up here in Scottsdale Mountain. It's a double-gated community. Uh, you're looking at over 4,500 square feet with the guest house. Uh, beautiful views. That's the, the best part of this property is you're sitting up here high on the mountain. Where we're sitting, we're actually 600 feet above the level of downtown Phoenix. Wow. So if you can just imagine the views you have from here um, as the uh, when the sun goes down, seeing the, uh, the sun come over the mountains, the sunset's gorgeous. Yeah. Beautiful. And now do a walkthrough as we come through. I know we're we're looking out the window here at a beautiful fountain that we got here right. as we walk in. Yeah, there, there's views actually from every single room in the house, the bedrooms, the master, the office, uh, especially uh, when you walk into the kitchen, the uh, the huge glass windows, you see you see the whole valley. Mm. It's beautiful, especially looking over the, the negative edge pool. That is really cool. And it goes right down into a canyon. Right down into the canyon. And the house was, the designer of this house had a, the perfect lot because, I mean, they centered, looking out the great room from the kitchen. I mean, you literally have, basically imagine a saddle. Yeah. And you get the saddle view of, of uh, downtown Phoenix and um, probably the Indian Reservation, um, et cetera. It's really good. The views are Fantastic. Yeah. Square footage again? What are we talking? With the guest house, you're uh, just around 4,500 square feet. It's a nice size house. Yeah. Very nice. A lot of the homes up it's here just don't... right. Yeah. Split floor plan. You know, the, the, the kids' bedrooms are on one side, the parents' other. It's funny, when you walk it, and I said to Bryce, I said, you know, it's the right size. It is. It's just enough and not too much. Yeah. And list price for this? It's just under $1.5 million. Under right, yep. so and the, the key here is to jumbo financing still much very much available, Jeff. Yeah, jumbo financing's great. We can you know do a million and a half dollar loan with as little as ten percent down. Rates are as good and in, in most cases are actually somewhat better than conventional. Hmm. And again, you're up in Scottsdale Mountain, very exclusive yeah. guard gate at the first gate, and then you've got a second gate. You have a second guard gate. Uh, it's called the canyons, this, mm. where this home is sitting. So you actually have double-gated security, which is Fantastic. nice. Anything else about the house? We failed to ask anything else you would like to add as far as we're talking here? Well, really high-end finishes and, and, and really just the views. I mean, it's magnificent. Mm. Now let's swing over to Tempe because you've got kind of a background working with people in that Tempe area. Tell us about that. Yeah, so I have a, uh, a listing out in Tempe that recently went under contract uh, hoping to close here in the next couple weeks, mm-hmm. and it's in the one hundred thirty-five thousand price range. One hundred thirty-five thousand. Now, is that a single family detached? What is that? It's a two-bedroom, two-bath condo, condo with a double master bedroom split. Fantastic for how much? One hundred thirty-two. One thirty-five. So it's perfect for two college kids. Yeah, it's yeah. perfect. And for one hundred thirty-five thousand, what kind of payment are we talking on that? Wow. I got to think about this. I know one. that's going to be um, cheap, isn't no, it? No, you're at about a thousand dollars a month yeah. with taxes, insurance, and your HOA. Your yeah. HOA in a condo is probably going to be about two hundred dollars a month. So your principal and interest is about seven fifty. Your insurance is only going to be twenty five or thirty dollars a month. Your taxes are probably a hundred, and then you throw in your HOA. So you know, if you're a parent looking to send your kid to ASU for four years, and you're going to probably pay anywhere between six and twelve hundred dollars month for rent yeah here you could buy this particular unit if my math is correct and one of your children can have a roommate and basically the roommate's paying half the mortgage you're paying five hundred dollars a month um plus you have the benefits of um the write-offs because it's now an investment property so the entire thing is a write-off versus if you pay rent for your student none of it's a write-off yeah and, you know, the market's going in the right direction. You do some appreciation. It really is a – I do quite a number of, quote, unquote, kitty condos a year, yeah. and it's, it's a great investment. And it's, a, it's a big part of the, 
the market in the Tempe area. Yeah, and that's the key. And that you've actually helped people with this. Yeah, that that is the exact situation with this one. Actually, they you know they were looking at the numbers and. With with the mortgage, they'd be paying less than if they would have to pay rent in, in an apartment yeah. right by ASU. Makes total sense. Plus, it's you know, and, and I've looked at and I've talked to, you know, because obviously I talk to buyers and they you know ask, should I do this? Should I do that? And a lot of times, I say, you know what? If your kid, you know, if you have the opportunity, put the kid on the mortgage, even if he's not paying, let him start to learn about managing property. It's a great experience for the child. Yeah. Okay, you learn some responsibility. In many cases, a lot of these, especially ones that have been bought in the last five or six years, have been bought so right that they don't even sell them when the child graduates. Either the, the child will, will stay there and live for a while and then becomes an investment property for them. You've got a story on that. Right, yeah. Just uh, about two and a half years ago, I sold a couple their first home. It was a condo uh, in Scottsdale, a two-bedroom, two-bathroom. And they're just getting to the point in their lives where they, they got a puppy. They're thinking about having a kid here in the next year or so. And they'd like something with a backyard, maybe a pool, an area for the kid to play. And so they are in the process of buying a, a nice three-bedroom, two-bath house in North Phoenix hmm. on about a third of an acre. We're actually under contract on that now. Hmm. And a beautiful home with. Well, the they didn't have to sell their other property. Yeah, they kept it as and, a rental, and and they're going to actually hold on to that condo because they got it at such a at a good time in the market uh, with the the rental with the rates, and they're going to be cash flow positive every month on the with the mortgage and the rent they're going to be receiving. You know, by the time that child, you know, their child's ready for college, that house is paid off, and you've got fifteen hundred dollars a month free and clear. You got it. Yeah, excellent. Phone number. How can people reach you? My phone number is six zero two four six three. Eight five six four, and the website. My website for the You Call the Shots team is bryceshots.com. And spell that: B R Y C E S C H O T Z dot com. And phone number one more time. Again, my phone number is six zero two four six three eight five six four. Jeff Obraski, Homeowners Financial Group, six zero two four four five. Nine zero nine four. Everybody, stay tuned. We're gonna do a break. We're gonna be right back.